What? Is up. My friends, good morning. Fucking, look at that, there's stars in the sky. I just know you can see stars in my phone. My friends, it is a beautiful, crisp, fall, chilly weather type of morning here in Arkansas. I don't understand why Wednesday is more prone to enchiladas than any other food. Tuesday to tacos. But I appreciate that we have those days. But let me tell you, Saturday is a chili day. Saturday is the Halloween chili cook-off at Clear Channel Metroplex, the one that I compete in. in my 11th year or 12th year? Man! But see, this year I'm not competing. My son is in his Boy Scout troop. I might give a little bit of encouragement. I'll let them use all my equipment, but they are competing. This is going to be a blast. What do y'all meet Jersey? Jersey's a great guy. He's uh, the guy that laughs along with, uh, with everybody else. And he's a radio personality at uh, the morning show you sometimes see me on on Fridays that's the radio station that's putting this on man I love chili cook-off it's just the best damn time of the year but it's my Christmas this Halloween chili cook-off gonna be a blast I'll, let, I'll show you some videos tomorrow what I'm gonna be doing all day is getting all that shit together buying ingredients making sure that everything is set up and right. We've got spoons and paper towels and trash bags and the little things, hand towels, the things that you don't normally think of that you forget and you get there and you ain't got can opener. Little things. Also, I always bring a little extra of something because there's always gonna be somebody who needs something. And this chili cook-off is more about friendship and camaraderie and seeing people that you only see once a year that's been doing it for, for 11 years too. Or six or seven, however long they've been doing it. Chili cook-off. Anyway, just want to tell you I love you and I care about you and I'm thinking about you and I am praying for you. Be happy. Smiles. You know... Google is a monster. But they, just, they just gave me the biggest check they've ever given me, thanks to the, my chili recipe. I don't. So I've made more money since they've started fucking with shit than I had before. And every year, that, that I have a couple of videos that just keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Now, I've got one, that Day Without Immigrants, that you saw that picture, uh, it's, it's in there, that's been stricken. It's like my fourth highest performing video. And the damn thing is, uh, it's just nothing but talk good about immigrants. And, uh, you know, they've demonetized it. And I have requested a review, and they just won't. They've abandoned Hillary. Because you can't monetize a video about Barack Obama. We found this out. You can't monetize a video about Donald Trump. We found this out. Because all I said was Trump, 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 Trump. Motherfucker. Got nothing to do with it. You can say motherfucker all you want. Motherfucker. 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 Yes. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Roger. Morning. Yeah. Love it. <laughs> Witch's teat has nothing on that man right now. <laughs> no, it looks like he's got one of them fancy boxes, probably got heater blowing on him and shit. Hell. Yeah. God, I just love all you people. Hey, you Roger Papa. I love you, brother. Everybody pray for old Roger. He's fixing to go get some bone marrow. That's got to be a rough procedure. They crack open your damn femur, don't they, Roger? I don't know exactly how that's done, but replacing bone marrow is a, 
it seems like a bad fucking thing. Or, or maybe they blend it up and then put it, drill a hole in your leg. And that's, I don't know how they do that, but bone marrow seems like a, a fucking arduous, painful process. And I'm praying for you, my friend. God, man. You are a strong person. I, I really, really am impressed with uh, your bravery and your strength in all this. God bless you. God bless you. Seems that everybody is having issues with all this crap right now with Google and YouTube. and just, They'll get it figured out. I think right now what the problem is is they're just running around in circles. They've got, they had an algorithm that worked. Then uh, what they did is, what they should do is just have so that advertisers can opt in or opt out of whatever they want. They need to give the advertisers more options. They also need to give, well, you, through analytics, you can choose who does and who doesn't and what kind of ads put on your, you can choose that, but not enough of us use that. I think what you need to do is get rid of your tags. If you have, look on there and you know, you have automatic tags. I have automatic tags set on my videos anyway. See what, you know, take one off if you're getting stricken a lot. Uh, try and figure out a way to change the way you do your titling, uh, your thumbnails, do custom thumbnails. Uh, all of my thumbnails are me going, apparently, it just seems like it. Uh-oh. Look. Look who it is. Morning, Kenny. Morning, Kendall. My friend, thank you so much. Uh, check, check out these shirts. Yeah, Kendall. Kendall cut all that vinyl and showed me how to do that for, the, for my daughters. Uh, and I've got to send that to them today. <laughs> but yeah, Kendall Wright, my friend, at Wright's Prints. If you need something like that done, Wright's Prints, uh, I, I do believe Wright's Prints is a YouTube channel. Go check out Mr. Kendall Wright. Uh, he's not super active. Uh, maybe we could all encourage him, us guys from the community, because super talented guy. He figures out shit. He's a, he's, he's a maker in progress. He's at the infancy of his makership because he's got such ingenuity and, and a different perspective and a way of looking at things that uh, I've learned so much from him. And, you know, I've been doing shit for my whole life. And in him trying to figure out how to do something, he stumbles upon things that just, that's amazing to me. Kendall Wright, my good friend. If you check him out on Facebook too. Uh, Wright's Prince on uh, Facebook and Instagram and uh, here on YouTube. All right, I love you. Reach out to somebody in need, help them fuckers. Uh, it's always good to reach down and pull someone up. Do everything you can to help others out. I love you, I'm praying for you. I am thinking about you and I'm ever grateful for you. Click that like button, ding the bell there, subscribe. Gotta say it. Love you. Have a good one. Little doggy.